Hi, fourth graders. Um, on Monday, I taught you all about conductors and insulators. So today you get to do some of your, your own practice. So what you're going to do is after you watch this video, you're going to click on the link that says Circuit Construction Kit DC, and you're going to go into the intro. So you'll click here where it says intro. Now you use this last week to build and practice with circuits, but today we're going to use this again so we can build a tester circuit and we can test different materials. So you're all going to need to drag out a battery and a wire and what happened? I'll start again. A wire and a battery and you're going to need another wire and you're going to need a light bulb and then you're going to need another wire so this looks like the tester that i showed you on monday and it's an open circuit you have a gap here if you connect, collect connected these the electrons would start flowing your light bulb would light and you would close the circuit but we're going to open it back up and we're going to test some materials in here now over in this toolbox if you click the bottom arrow, you're gonna see some materials you can test. So you can test a dollar bill, a paper clip, a coin, an eraser, a pencil. And this pencil is different than the one I did in the video because it has two sharpened ends. So you're actually testing the graphite that is a pencil is made of. You can test a hand and you can test a dog. I'll just show you an example with this thing called a fuse. So I would put the fuse here. I would connect it over here and my light bulb lights, you can see the electrons moving. So I know that this fuse is what? A conductor or an insulator? We would call it a conductor because the electricity is flowing through and the light bulb is lighting. So then I wanna test something else. So I'm gonna double click this, it turns yellow. I click the trash and I have my testing circuit again, and then you could drag out the dollar bill, test it, find out if it's a conductor or an insulator, test the paper clip, test the coin, test the eraser, test the pencil, test the hand, and test the dog. When you finish with this, um, you all you have to do is go into the Google Docs and you're just going to tell me about one thing you tested. So there'll be a form, to, a Google Docs form to fill out, and you're just going to type in one of the things you tested, and if you found out if it was a conductor or an insulator, and how you knew it was a conductor or an insulator. So think about when I tested the fuse, I would say, I tested the fuse, I know it's a conductor, and the reason I know is because the light bulb lit. Okay, and you guys can pick and tell me about any of the items that you tested. All right, have fun learning about electricity today.